Okay, it's time for the big reveal. We're gonna taste test. Sophia, you actually created all these meals and figured out how to make this work. So first, talk to me a little bit about the science behind it while I take a bite and see what I think. So yes. uh, how did you do it? Go ahead, here, so, Kelly. So the five benefits of the Good Eats uh, meal plans and the cafe are lean protein, okay. complex carbs, healthy fats, uh, reduced sodium and fresh fruits and vegetables. Mm. So the black and chicken panini that you have right here, that's with a whole wheat pita. It's lean chicken, fresh uh, vegetables. We have uh, lettuce, tomato, our own homemade chipotle dressing, and jack cheese, low And it's delicious. Is there Thank avocado you. in there? Yes, it has fresh avocado. I love that because it's nice and creamy. The chicken is really good. And I wasn't sure how I was going to feel about the bread, but the bread is great. Thank you. It's really nice. Now, Kelly over here. Yes. She has a shepherd's pie, but it's not a traditional shepherd's pie. So what is that? So that's a paleo shepherd's pie, which is wheat-free and dairy-free. Okay. Um, the uh, top layer is a sweet potato puree. And then the bottom layer is actually lean ground beef, fresh uh, carrots, onions, peppers. And it's made with a low-sodium chicken stock. Mm. Did you try it, Taylor? No, I didn't. Okay, get involved. I'm going for second, okay. so it's good. <laughs> And now we're going to make Taylor taste that. And Taylor was trying an egg. What's the egg dish? So that's our avocado smash. It's made with a whole wheat toast. It's a fresh arugula on top with a little bit of lemon and olive oil. And um, avocado, just blended avocado, uh, fresh eggs. All right, Taylor, what's your favorite so far? This is awesome. I love egg. avocado. Okay. The chipotle mayo is awesome, too. And you tried the Brussels sprouts? Right? Yeah, great. And Awesome. awesome. I love Brussels sprouts too, so I'm biased. All right, so that's good. And we also have some desserts on here. The Leaning Tower of Yogurt has been leaning a little bit, so we have to try it. Yes. And what, we do. what goes on? This is the eight, right? Simply yes, eight? Only eight. Um, only eight, is, super close mm -hmm. to that. Okay. Eight calories per ounce, and it's only eight ingredients. And the sweetener is fructose, which is naturally fruit sweetener. Okay, and what is this? Good. This is a muffin? Yes. Let's so see. Good. The muffin is actually a paleo pumpkin chocolate chip muffin. So we make that with um, coconut flour, oh, yeah. a little bit of honey, uh, pumpkin puree, and uh, carob chocolate chips, which are vegan chocolate chips. And what's your favorite, this item? That one is, is that my why favorite, yes. It's a healthy cheesecake made with non-fat <laughs> Greek yogurt, okay. uh, low-fat cream cheese, and the crust is an almond flour crust. All right, so who's going for this? This is gonna be Kelly. Right. Oh, just kidding. All right, so Kelly's not good. All right, so wow. I mean, tough job, and you know, somebody's got to do it. I'm, I'm slightly nervous, but also excited. Oh, really good. Yes, thank you. Creamy. Fantastic. Strawberry, I like mm -hmm. it. I really super love the yogurt, though. <laughs> And just really quickly for the, for the people at home mm -hmm. who kind of didn't understand 100% the concept of how the meal plan works. If I know I'm on, say, paleo or if I'm on, you know, low carb, whatever it is, mm -hmm. you can kind of custom make that, right? Yes. So I have a uh, spreadsheet of all the macronutrients broken down. Mm -hmm. So you know how many grams of protein, carbs, and fat you're getting in every meal so you can customize it to your needs. Now, when we were just here, true story. Two women came in, looked like a mom and a daughter. Mm -hmm. the, the daughter had lost 10 pounds. The mom had lost, I think it was more than 13. Mm -hmm. And, you know, they were going on and on about how healthy they felt and how good the food is. How does that make you feel to that know that you're me, part of that? That makes me feel amazing. That's exactly, like, what I'm here for is to create a possibility that you can eat healthy. You can enjoy it. You can feel full. You don't have to starve yourself. So that's the best feeling in the world. I like the don't starve yourself part. And if you're eating this food, you're not going to starve yourself because it is Good Eats. We're at the Good Eats Cafe here in Amityville, right next to Big Al's. You can't miss it. So if you want to try something healthy to eat, feel healthy, but also eat something delicious, you agree? Good? Yeah. Thumbs up? Yep. All right. Up. Good stuff. Let's get eating. <laughs> Super good. Yeah.